Welcome to To Your Health. I'm your host, Rhonda Alfred, and joining us on this episode is Dr. Piomia Brown, sleep medicine specialist at Terrebonne General Health System. She's going to be talking to us today about our new sleep medicine center. Welcome to the show, Dr. Brown. Thank you, Rhonda. It's good to see you again. Good to see you. Let's get started with you telling us a little bit more about yourself and your role at Terrebonne General. Awesome. Well, again, I'm Piomia Brown. Um, I am the one of the pulmonary and critical care specialists here at Terrebonne General, but I also specialize in sleep medicine. And as we talked about before, my role is to evaluate patients with all sort, sorts of sleeping disorders, um, including insomnia, which I can't sleep, sleeping too much, which is a thing, um, sleep disordered breathing, which is sleep apnea, and even nightmares are part of a parasite insomnia um, syndrome that we have. So I see a lot of patients with those disorders and we're really excited to fill up our clinic, our roster and help those patients get better sleep. Who knew there were so many sleep disorders? Exactly, so many disorders. Well, tell us more about the New Sleep Medicine Center and how is it being offered at Terrebonne General? Perfect. So again, we see patients in our clinic based on referrals from our subspecialists or our primary care physicians here via Terrebonne General and within the entire community. Um, once we receive a referral, um, we evaluate patients in our clinic. Um, they are able to see me. We talk about their sleep problems. We do questionnaires and surveys to evaluate severity of their diseases and what types. And then now we offer, we're very excited, we opened up our sleep lab. And so what we offer there, patients will not have to, especially local patients, won't have to travel very far in order to have their sleep testing evaluations done. They're actually able to come here to our facility where there are rooms equipped like hospital rooms with our bathrooms and, and all of the things that we need to effectively treat patients here. Mm -hmm. um, and so they stay overnight for just a little while, just overnight, and we're able to get a lot of information about their sleep, including what stages of sleep they're in, if they're in light sleep or deep sleep, um, their heart function, their lung function, their movements. We're able to see quite a bit with that test. That's called a polysomnography. And we also do home sleep studies. They pick the devices up here, they take it home, they sleep with it, bring them back, and we're able to get good data from there. And okay. from that information, we're able to classify patients based on their sleep disorders. And that's just one part of the evaluation, but we're able to do that, and we now offer it here at Terrebonne General. That's wonderful. Can you tell us what process a patient has to go through to get the initial consultation? Very simple process. They have to go through the referral system from their primary care doctor or their subspecialist. So we receive, we have great communication and relationships with primary care physicians in the community, our cardiologist group here, great relationships with them, endocrinology, um, anyone really, especially if we have issues with sleep disorders Sort of breathing, a lot of those subspecialists will all, all, all order the sleep studies, and by the time they get to me, after their referrals, we have some information to treat with. Okay, and you mentioned a few of the sleep disorders. What kind of sleep disorders do you treat? I treat them all. <laughs> Anything that you can think of under the sun. Um, a lot of people, questions that I get is, what about sleeping too much? That is a thing, hypersomnia, sleeping the day away and still not feeling refreshed. I've literally had a patient come to me and said, I keep hitting my wife and I don't know why. That is a sleep disorder that you're not crazy. These things happen in sleep and that could be a sign of other disorders. But you have to come in and we'll talk about it. But nothing is strange, nothing is abnormal. We wanna treat you. That's just to name a few, restless legs or some. Um, um, even people have seizures in sleep, but we can see all of that with wow. appropriate evaluation. What a relief to know that there is help for people yes. having these problems. Absolutely. Are the sleep medicine services covered by insurance? 
most all of your services are things that we offer are covered by insurance and of course that varies um, based on your insurance just like any other subspecialty um, and any other form of treatment but they are covered by insurance because of course sleep is important <laughs> it's mm -hmm. very important to your health and it affects other disorders as well so yes great news and how do you measure the effect effectiveness of treatment and monitor patients over time just like with any disorder, this is a collaborative effort. We work really closely with the patients, patients' families, because a lot of the reports and things that we get are via patients' family members. Patients don't know what happen, happens when they sleep a lot of the times. So we measure that based on patient response. How are you feeling? How, how are you feeling? How is your sleep? Are you sleeping longer? We use a survey that we ask our patients to do every single time they come in. And sometimes they, people don't really understand, but that's tracking the effectiveness of the treatments that we're offering. So surveys and really based on that good relationship that we build with patients. Okay, and what's the one main thing you want people to know about the Sleep Medicine Center? It is open. We are here. We are eager to treat your diseases. We are excited. We have a lot to offer you. Don't be afraid to come in. And, and one other thing, it's not just about CPAP. There's so many things that we offer and that we can treat, and we're happy to do so. Okay, and how do patients schedule an appointment? They should call our clinic line. You probably have the number on your screen. Mm -hmm. Call that clinic line um, at, and see if you can get an appointment. That would also be based on referral as well. So go to your primary care doctors or your subspecialist and we will go from there. All right, that sounds wonderful. Thank you so much for sharing this helpful information. Thank you, Rhonda, for having me again. For more information about the Sleep Medicine Clinic at Terrebonne General Health System, visit tghealthsystem.com. Thanks for being with us on To Your Health. I'm Rhonda Alford, and we'll see you right back here next week.